Hello all, John Mergadich here. Just making sure y'all remember this lovely house over here on Shaw Butte. I know you're all in Texas there. Just got the uh, grass cut. Ready for our pictures tomorrow, about three o'clock on Sunday. I just want to come by, make sure there wasn't like a broom sitting out or things sitting there. The photographer doesn't move things, okay? So I just want to make sure we're kind of ready. Trash cans are right up against the wall. And uh, that'll give me some extra light. I'm gonna go through here. I turn on lights just so we can kind of have Maybe a little bit better video. Here we go. I've opened up those window coverings. I'm about ready to take those things down. I don't think they do us any good. Just a thought. I like your opinion, quite frankly. In fact, same in that front bedroom. Same question. They don't seem to do us a lot of good. Maybe uh, we could get those. You just pull those down. I'll, usually I'll hang them in a in the closet so that people can use them if they want to someday. There's no showing today that I'm aware of. Sometimes people can come in, we don't know it. It's okay over here because we're vacant. Oh. Our closet, we all know that's fine. So I left the candle there, kind of a little something. I'll go this way first. Be going out in the back just a minute. Itching to paint it, but I know we didn't want to go that far, and I totally understand that. There we go. Master, two more. Devoid of like brooms or pieces of trash. There's your carpet. Just looking out the window. Windows closed, secured. Out there. And Christina, and all of you actually. See, I, I'm just thinking about just pulling those off. You know, sometimes, sometimes less is more. But again, please uh, see if this is. Anyway, thoughts would be appreciated. Same in here. Open the store up before. Here's a question. I'm wondering if we might come back and paint this back side of the house. That just doesn't look good. You know, a long time ago, I had this problem. And we took a piece of... A thin peat like eighth inch product it went up maybe four inches, six inches. Just trimmed it at the bottom. Trimmed it, trimmed it, ran it all the way across in that instance. We're picking this up. This is anyway, subject for discussion, okay you guys? Moving on. All the stuff's off. Hey, guy charged me 200 bucks for the yard. It's a bargain. We need to use him. 
buck came all the way back. They just get busy. Yard looks nice. He sprayed for weeds. I asked about emergent, but quite frankly, I think we reach the limit of our ability to communicate, my ability to speak Spanish. But for $200, I thought he gave us a good value. And he was spraying for weeds. And again, as you can see from the front, he did a pretty good job. Go. go in the garage. I want to check one more thing. of uh, little tubes in there. It might be old too. I mean, look, it was drilled there before. Yeah. Anyway. That's it. Hey, I'm all done. I'm going to take this back, upload it. Have a few of the paints in there, which by the way, helped us. Okay. Uh, there were some in there that we were actually able to use and such. But I hope everybody's doing well. Uh, let me know on the window coverings what you think. I'll be glad to certainly go along with everybody's thinking. And uh, that's it. I'll try to get this off uh, to everyone this evening. Uh, photography is tomorrow. I should hopefully have pictures by tomorrow evening. If not, they'll be coming in on Tuesday. But we'll see what happens there. And that is it, you guys. Talk to you soon. See you. Bye.